Rumours have long swirled about internal struggles at Red Bull Racing, but recent developments have the potential to blow the team wide open. Sources paint a picture of Adrian Newey, the legendary designer, potentially leaving the team he helped architect into a force of Formula One. Red Bull is uncharacteristically silent on the matter, only confirming his contract runs until at least 2025. Today on Racing Avenue, we break down this situation. We'll discuss Newey's immeasurable impact, the immediate and long-term fallout of his possible departure, and how this connects to Max Verstappen, Christian Horner, and the wider power struggles within Red Bull Racing. Adrian Newey is an F1 giant. His career includes legendary stints at Williams and McLaren, even a foray into IndyCar, before ultimately settling back in the UK to focus on family. Christian Horner's bold move of signing Newey away from his rivals was the catalyst that launched Red Bull's era of dominance under Sebastian Vettel back in the 2010s, and now with Max Verstappen. Empires are not eternal, and the same goes for Red Bull's technical team. Although the engineering depth of Red Bull makes it unlikely for an immediate downfall, the absence of Adrian Newey would be a significant blow. Rumours suggest that rival teams such as Ferrari, Aston Martin and Mercedes are showing great interest in Newey. This has raised concerns about Red Bull's future in terms of their technical capabilities, creating questions about their long-term sustainability. Amidst all this is the Horner controversy. Tensions sparked by an employee who served both Horner and Newey as a personal assistant have created a volatile situation. Insiders suggest Newey finds his position untenable under these circumstances. It's not just about personal conflict. Red Bull's upper management has seen recurring clashes. Who holds the ultimate sway, the Austrian ownership or F1 management in the UK? The outcome of Newey's situation could influence the very power structure of the team, including the fate of Christian Horner himself. If Newey does leave, where does he go? Speculation naturally points to rivals, maybe even Ferrari or Aston Martin luring him away, but that might be too convenient an answer. This appears deeply personal for Newey. He could just as easily step away, focusing on his newfound sailing passion and personal life. F1 bosses watch this situation with interest. Could this shake up the landscape? In the immediate sense, likely not. It will take time for any rival to reap the true rewards of Newey's genius. Newey is contracted until at least the end of 2025 at Red Bull, as confirmed by the Red Bull team at the back of Newey's departure reports. What that means is that the earliest arrival team would be able to acquire the services of the design genius would be from 2027 onwards, a year already into the new regulations. Max Verstappen is the reigning champion, yet he's stuck in the middle of this chaos. Does Newey's exit make him rethink his own future? Verstappen wants to keep winning, but Red Bull will need serious technical prowess to retain dominance, especially come 2026. There's also the Marco factor. Verstappen is close to Dr Helmut Marco, the notoriously ruthless figure who discovers and mentors young drivers for Red Bull. If Marco were to leave, that could have a major impact on Verstappen's own commitment. In the midst of the chaotic Formula One season, Mercedes is not sitting idle. Toto Wolff, the team principal, has expressed his admiration for Max Verstappen, emphasising that drivers are always looking for a fresh start. Although Mercedes is currently struggling, their long-term potential, especially with someone like Verstappen behind the wheel, cannot be ignored. The 2026 regulations mark a reset of rules and regulations, which may be a turning point for Mercedes to come out on top. The new regulations, which will heavily rely on engine power and battery, provide an opportunity for Mercedes to excel. With the use of sustainable fuels and a fuel partner like Petronas, Mercedes could be the team to watch out for in the upcoming regulations. There are rumours that Max Verstappen's team may meet with Mercedes' top management after the Miami Grand Prix. Mercedes is offering a multi-year deal worth up to €150 million Euros per year, along with ambassadorship and the possibility of bringing on Helmut Marko as an advisor to keep Verstappen satisfied, However, Red Bull will certainly make a counter-offer and make promises, but can they meet their assurances, particularly with Red Bull powertrains inexperience when compared to engine giants such as Mercedes and Ferrari? The dance between the two teams seems far from over, and it is unclear where it will lead. Red Bull finds itself in unfamiliar territory. The passing of their co-founder still weighs heavily on the team, and the potential loss of Adrian Newey could cause further disruption to the team's foundation. 
This raises critical questions about their ability to retain key personnel and whether this internal turmoil will translate to weakness on the track. The situation surrounding Adrian Newey's departure from Red Bull is intricate and ever-changing. It has the potential to reshape not only the future of Red Bull, but also the entire Formula One landscape. We will keep a close eye on this story here on Racing Avenue. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more in-depth Formula One news.